the cattle wagon was weaving in the road in and out of its lane. Um, quite clearly the driver was distracted in some way or impaired in some way uh, and wasn't driving correctly in its lane and this caused some concern for the witnesses. His account was that he hadn't done anything wrong at all. He was quite clearly in his lane. He couldn't give any reason as to why the collision occurred. It emerged once the um, blood of the lorry driver had been analysed that he'd taken cannabis and amphetamines. You know, at the time I wasn't aware that um, the chap was under the influence of drugs. I mean, I've since found out that he was on, under the influ influence of drugs. Obviously, that makes it 10 times worse because it's no longer an accident. Um, you know, the fact that he was driving a HGV, the consequences are horrendous. You know, an HGV on a road like that. This, this driver who was responsible for this collision was clearly impaired. Um, he, he went onto the wrong side of the road and he, he, in a heavy goods vehicle, he ripped in half a, a Ford Transit van, which killed the father of two, two boys who were in their early 20s and also the loving husband of, of his wife, Fiona. He really was the centre figure of the family, there's no doubt about that.